in skip point just waiting for the barge to come back from the other side it's over there now so we're sort of just all lined up here waiting to get over should be about 10 minutes to get there and back so about half an hour wait because it just left so we've got our tires down about 20 psi and we're just hanging around and then we'll go past our camp for the night to Lake Mackenzie for a bit of a squiz so see how we go but anyway here's some video <laughs> just about to pull up for some lunch at Lake Boomingin bit of a wrap for lunch, got some green shit, <laughs> some head shit. Corned beef and turkey. Mm mm mm. We'll go down to the lake and have a squeeze. Alright, some fun fact about Lake Boomingin that we just went and visited. It's actually the world's largest perch dune lake. Um, so that's pretty cool. Um, and it's only the only one that's stream fed as well so a bit of fun and exciting things there it's quite pretty nice and quiet and secluded but we're going to keep making our way up towards um, Lake Mackenzie stop at a few other spots see how we go just heading down for a look at Lake Birabeen so this one is suggested as an alternative during the school holidays to Lake Mackenzie same white sand you can see from here same crystal clear water just gonna go have a check but we are still gonna go to Lake Mackenzie we're not in school holidays so hopefully the crowds aren't too big we thought we'd check this out anyway bit of a walk it's a beautiful spot and all to yourself how is it oh. it's colder than the other one but all right it's pretty good Nobody else around at all. How good is that? And here we are, the crown jewel 
in Fraser Island's Lake Crown. Look at that, Lake Mackenzie right here. Beautiful island. Huh? So where are we going today? Today we're going to the beach. Yeah. <laughs> we're gonna head out and then we're gonna go to what Eli Creek, the Mahina Wreck, the Pinnacles, um, and we're camping up near uh, Cathedral Beach tonight. So that's where we'll make our way to. Awesome. So we spent last night at Central Station. So we'll make a move. Let's do it. Gonna get in. It's gonna be cold as I reckon. <laughs> mm. Ooh, he reckons. <laughs> is it lovely? Lovely. Look how clear that is. Oh yeah, that's warm. So pretty. Getting a bit deep. You and me stuck on the ocean now. Nothing but waves in this filling in. I want to dry up, but you just keep on going, don't you? I don't even know how we got here. All my reasoning have disappeared. I want to bury the wreck. You know, there's not much left, it's pretty rusted out, but we'll go have a look closer. Drift inside this dome. I will not let us fade away. It's not a price I want to pay, and it's not too late. No, we lost our purpose, chasing all that surplus. You were all that I need. This is the Pinnacles. So it's different coloured sands, red mostly, white you can see there, in case you get a good shot with it on the drone hopefully. We'll go for this little walk and see what's up here. So basically for a really long time, like 700,000 years or something, these sands been worn away by wind um, and it's revealed sort of ancient sands underneath 
it's been stained over time by the iron that's in the soil so that's why it's got that rich red color um, it's just been worn down over time by all the wind and rain erosion that happens on the beaches so that's pretty cool just set up our camp on the beach cathedral beach this one is but there's a whole lot of rain should be a fun night it's a wild dingo come to check us out <laughs> just coming over there's not too many people around champagne. <laughs> not that kind of champagne Let's head over here and have a chill slowly we are drowning that's why you need to come with me with me with me turn around 180 degrees and cross the sea I will not let us fade away It's not a price I wanna pay And it's not too late No, we lost our purpose Chasing all that surplus You were all that I need I feel that we can break free We can still go back there To a place with no cares We can turn this ship around We can turn this ship around All the way back home from the kitchen Kingfisher Bay now waiting for 
the barge it's not due till 2 30. Uh, we didn't know how long it was going to take us to get back here from Waddy Point so we sort of left a bit early now we got two hours to kill so <laughs> Um, we just booked our barge and now we wait. We're just gonna look out here. Pretty good view though. That's what we need, we need a jet ski. <laughs> the barge back from this side is a bit more expensive than the Inskip Point one. So I recommend if you don't mind the drive, depending where you're going, what you're doing, just take the Inskip one. But um, it's alright, we'll sit, chill out. We'll make our way to Bunnerberg once we finally get on the barge and across there. Well, the time has finally come. The ferry's here, we're ready to go. Sadly leaving Fraser behind, heading for the next adventure.